Hey everyone, welcome back to our Fallout Show Reaction. I'm Honest. And I'm Mare. And today we're going to be watching episode four, The Ghouls. Uh, it's been a minute since we've watched episode three, about like a week or so, but uh, it's still pretty fresh in our minds and we are excited to get started. Uh, I am a little bit sick, so I apologize if my voice is a bit scratchy, but let's jump right into it. Let's do it. Oh, lovely. That was huge. Yeah, rad roaches uh, kind of suck. Oh, look at the little stars on the... Oh, yeah, was that like a sidewalk or something? I don't know. Was that Hollywood Boulevard? Interesting. Maybe. Like, they were at... They were near it last episode, right? I don't know. Clinic. Okay. What is that? Are we getting a super mutant? I doubt it. Oh, that camera was very shaky there. Warped. Lucy's looking pretty shaky herself, too. Yeah. Dehydrated, irradiated. She's been better. Oh, is it a ghoul going feral? Ghouls plural, that's the name of the episode. Yeah. Oh, geez. Oh, that's what we're doing today. Okay. You yeah, for that bounty, too, huh? Yep. Look, his, like, brain is exposed. Yeah. We haven't seen in the games many ghouls, like, right on the precipice of becoming feral, right? Maybe I'm just forgetting, but this is really interesting to see. This is so sad. Yeah, this is this is the fate of every ghoul, basically. You know, it's hard. Oh my god, that's literally me anytime anybody asks me how I'm feeling. You know, it's hard out here. This sucks. Yeah, you don't have to have any vials, do you? <laughs> yeah. So they seem to be taking some kind of drug to keep them from turning feral. I thought it was just Radaway, right okay. but that's not been a thing in the game so far, so. This is like genuinely hurting my heart, this poor boy. Yeah. Might want to clear out before things get ugly. I'm here just interested in the mechanics and completely ignoring the emotional side. <laughs> this is really sad. <sighs> okay. Oh. 28 years cry. since I first started showing. <laughs> 28 years. Wow, that is... I wonder if he's as old as, uh, Coop. Uh-oh. He's gonna think that he has vials on him. Mmm. Remember how good food used to taste? He lost his in the water last episode, I think. Yeah, he did. Yeah. Lamb co mac and cheese. Hey. Uh, cream and... You know, my mom used to... <laughs> oh, yeah, valid. Valid. Oh. God, I, I I thought that was coming, but why, why did you? Oh, she doesn't know. She doesn't understand. Yeah, not me crying. Oh, he tried to give him a really good last memory with the apple pie. The, yeah, yeah. So in episode two, you asked me if they ate people, and I was like, oh no, only some of them are cannibals. Well, I was a little wrong. People starved, my mother included. Ah, that's how she. Well, I bet your daddy was first in line at the cookout. I wonder if there was, uh, if there's any truth to him because he knows the name. Yeah. The truth to that statement. How do you live like this? Why keep going? That is a good question, given that he's been doing it for 200 years. Why keep going? Why the fuck am I doing all the work? Oh. Now, come on, Vaulty. Ass jerky don't make itself. Not the ass jerky. Bacon? <laughs> Get you some yummy cool bacon co. <laughs> I don't think she's gonna eat it, but I guess she has no choice but to help him. Oh. And like that was his friend, it seemed like, too, which is. Well, they seemed like they knew each other. I don't know. I. These Fallout, like, intros where Fallout comes on the screen, they're always. They always are so good. Yeah. They do very well. I love with that them. they. Uh? Oh, it's the two of them competing, I think. Or, uh. Mm. Or running against each other, I guess. Some terrible things this creature must have been through. Creature? Oh my gosh, they are. Oh no. 
sir. Please is he trying to? Yeah. Oh God. It is the right. Like, they're trying to do the right thing, but it's in this case, I just don't think it's. I don't know. They, they are in a tricky kind of moral dilemma, I guess. Made pie, if you'd like a piece. Is it perfectly preserved pie? I hid. During the raid, I got in a storage space and I hid. You can't blame them. Honestly, I mean, that's what I would do. I would yeah. get in the storage yeah. container and hide. Living in your in the vault the whole life and then seeing that happen. Yeah, that's, that's so I, valid. I understand why he's upset, though, given what happened to his family and I mean, everyone else, too. Can't get angry and they'll just pee on the wall. Oh, my God, not the pee on the wall. I mean, you know it. No. <laughs> just kidding. Just tread lightly. Like the thoughts that he was having, like about just killing them. Mm. That's tread the start lightly. Of... Tread lightly sounds like a threat. Yes, definitely. <laughs> I just I want to know if she ate any. I don't think she would have. But no. Oh, that's the worst. That's the worst. I wonder if Maximus is gonna help her or if she's gonna. Oh, no. is she gonna drink it? Is no. she gonna drink it? Don't, don't do it. He's just, yeah. Oh, God. Oh, God. This is so inhumane. Like, he's not even offering her that. I mean, God. Uh. Nah, you're good. Oh, she's going to get so sick. <laughs> so, do all people end up ghouls eventually? Um. Oh! <gasps> I thought she was bound to him in some way, but I guess not. That's a lot of water. Oh my god! There you are, you little killer. He's so unfazed. Uh, oh. No! <gasps> no! I cannot. Did it happen? Yep. <gasps> no way. What in God's name was that? She's having the worst time right now. I literally now. could not watch. Oh, I couldn't do it. My gosh. Wow, I wonder if that wasn't his trigger finger, was that? Because that would be seriously debilitating. And same for her, if that was, I mean, I guess you can just do it with your different finger, but like, dang, that's brutal. And it was, it was like a slow cut. No. She's, she's up to something. She's also hey, not having a good time. I thought I'd just stop by and see how you're doing. How are you handling the uh, death of the father she of your unborn baby? Yep, way to put it bluntly, Did she lose chat. the baby? No, I think she still has it. Organizing some of Bert's things. Just her husband and an eye. Not much. Are they gonna? Yeah, I think I think that's the reason why she went. Because I don't think she was super fond of her husband. It's still sad that he died, of course, but. I think they're both lonely Maybe though. Took Bert's shoes. Oh, wow! What a way to put that. Thank you, Steph. Well. I'll try to wear them. Oh, God. I'll try to wear them. Not her making him cosplay her husband. husband? Yeah. It's a little. <laughs> oh, this is a little uncomfy. Not gonna lie. I do like Steph a lot as a character, but oh. Yeah, I knew that was gonna happen. Hey, I mean. They're probably Grief. related, right? Yeah, probably. Grief is an aphrodisiac, right? That's... Oh my god. Keep it on. Yes. I am Bert. Not I am Bert. Oh, at least the picture is looking away. <laughs> oh, she's... That's why she was wet. 
What a scene. That was that was a scene. That was and a half. It happened. Super Duper Mart. Hey, I love Super Duper Mart. Transaction. Oh, is he gonna sell her? Exchange one female mint condition. Oh god. Near mint condition. <laughs> condition grading requires physical evaluation. That's a Mr. Handy. That's a Mr. Handy. He's trading with a Mr. Handy. God, this guy sucks. Oh, the finger thing though. Oh my God. He really did that for absolutely no reason because he could have fetched a better yeah, price for yeah. her. He was just so, yeah, such a petty move. Mm. God, talk about rock bottom though. Now, for those of you who are, who are, uh, Fallout 4 fans, the Super Duper Mart in Lexington is one of my favorite dungeons, quote unquote, in the game. Oh yeah, he's having a hard time too. Oh, he's really having not a good time. Again, I don't feel bad. <gasps> Welcome to Super Duper Mart. Try a fresh Nuka-Cola Quantum. Sorry, I'm trying to distract from the fact that so much terrible shit is happening in the yeah. show right now. Welcome. I'm glad, uh, fudge? yeah. Fudge? The There's no fudge here. Ah, that won't do at all. Let's get you taken care of. Follow me. I'm scared. Yeah, no, this is not good. He's gonna harvest her. I think he's gonna harvest her. Mm -hmm. He's gonna be I mean, like, you're not in mint condition. Yeah. Harvest. Yeah. Yeah. Apologies for the mess. Time flies by lately. Especially since my temporal sensors went out in the Great War. It oh, must God. Have been a week ago, at least. What? What's that? <laughs> His time sensors. He said the war uh, must have been a week ago. Oh, nah, my. No. What have we here? Those posters are right out of Fallout. That's fine. Oh! Hey, you're lucky I don't have to use a thumb. Our finger infantry is in a sorry state. That's much better, isn't it? Can she, like, she can't move the, the joint, right? Oh, she can. That's so cool. Fallout signs. Thank you. No. No. I'm simply going to harvest your organs. Yeah, I was right. No, oh, shh. Why would he put a finger? I don't know why he would go through the trouble. Yeah. Maybe some weird glitches guess... programming where he needs to have her in like good condition. Oh, I don't know. Sure. Oh wow. Cake. Poor Lucy. Yeah. Like. I'm gonna put this in my fridge. These vault dwellers are such cupcakes. I love them so much. Oh. Well, this is awkward. Feel like getting out of the house. Why hasn't he taken it off? Yes. Oh shoot, okay. I mean, yeah, the doors are wide open. I, I, it's so interesting that they've kept the doors open. I know. I guess they've been preoccupied. Oh no, they, they blew it. Right, right, right. Remember the bomb? Uh, and why'd you come? To be honest, I don't know. Hey, that's the exact same flashlight sound from the, the game. Without the projectors on it, the, the room does feel like such a a box, you know, like a cage. There, there's not going to be anybody in here, is there? They're all I dead, mean, right? I, I assume the raiders got in from like, here, so yeah. like the door might still be open. I don't know. Uh, Probably not, but... Hey, geez. foosball. That's what happens when the foosball tournament gets too competitive. Blood, blood <laughs> on the... <laughs> Been there, done that. I mean, oh, not that. But, oh, that's a foosball. Okay, that's kind of a, that's a kind of a cool way to go out, though. I won't lie. <laughs> New weapon unlocked. The last bio signal detected was two years. Two ago. years ago. Jeez. Okay, that's a lot longer than I thought. I wonder if that plague that Lucy mentioned. Yeah. Was two years ago. I was thinking about that. Did she mention a time? I don't think she did. She right. She didn't. Oh. He killed himself. I wonder if 
I don't know. Something was released into the air. Wouldn't put it past vault I think they were fed, um, like, propaganda to harm each other eventually, mm. like, over time, so that they almost, it was, like, almost a normal thing. Yeah. Strangle each other with their hands. Some of them maybe knew what was happening and some of them didn't. We know the truth, yeah. It seems like not everyone was in on the... So yeah, maybe like the whole point was to give this like ideal society these interesting problems to solve, like a famine, and see how they react. I don't, I don't know. Ruthie. Mother? Yes, the power of a family rips through the tranquilizer. That is, oh! <gasps> they're alive? That's a ghoul. Oh, they're alive. That ghoul is probably bringing people here. Like, that's so... Oh, God. This is dark. Holy... 60 vials. We can do 60. I want to know what this stuff is. I've never been there myself. Hope to go there some days. Never been there myself. Oh, those are not sterile. He's not a very good medical robot. No. General Atomics, you need to put out an update soon. You can't do this! Please, I need my own. I wonder if you can trick it using like good wording or something. To like get around its programming. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, still now. Oh. Excuse me. Well done. She took science. She she's Oh, that was stressful. Oh my god. Is she gonna find some rat away or something? Because she could use some. I wonder if she's gonna sneak out or confront them some way. Hands up! Yeah. Do as I say and snip snip doesn't get hurt. Yeah, you might as well be holding an air conditioner hostage. Well, an air conditioner sounds nice. I love these characters. <laughs> That's why I put a Braxo draining fluid in his oh. <laughs> She took science! If you find a Braxo <laughs> in the wasteland, you gotta pick it up. Some good components in there. Not just me. Them too. That's not a good idea. She could just, like, kill them and... Yeah. Yeah. But she would. Yeah, oh, well, now they're, they're feral. All I gonna think, go towards her. Though. Yeah, I think some of them are gonna be feral. Oh no. Maybe not all of them. Okay. Lady, those those ones you don't. Oh. oh. Heather Chandler. Shoot. Yeah, she doesn't understand that they're feral. Oh god. She's gonna have to. She's not very smart, is she? No, I don't blame her for this one. Well, I mean, she's smart, but... The, the ghoul didn't really explain to her mm -hmm. why he killed. Feral ghouls in a super duper mart. Let's go. Is that a thing? That was, yeah, in Fallout 4. Oh. It's a really scary... Are we watching The Last of Us? Oh, gosh. The feral ghouls look awesome. Goodbye. Wow, they, they made those threatening. I mean, that's game accurate, but oh my god. Wait, did, did both of the dudes die? I think they both died, yeah. Martha. Is she, she seems to be, like, like Roger, like right on the edge. Yeah. Oh, she's gonna have to kill her. I hope she understands it's a mercy kill. 10 millimeter, cool. That, that's sorry. This is super sad, but gun model, you know. Oh. Whoa, she jumped really she high jumped there. Real high, yeah. God. Not the blood on our face again. Yeah. How do they do that? I wonder how they 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 must just like go like splatter. Psh, yeah. Gosh, this is brutal. Could I help you have a better day? No, thank you. 
Wow. I really love that the, the show kind of explored that, like, on the precipice of becoming feral. That yeah. was, like, heart-wrenching. I guess they, the only thing that they remember is their name. Yeah. Oh. Or, or seeming to. My god. Jeez. Oh, Did they hang themselves? <laughs> yeah. My brain was like, oh my god, free pit boys. <laughs> That's so funny. You can sell them for gaps. <laughs> um, you can't, actually. <laughs> If they were responsible, I, I know we said this already, but if they were responsible for the plague and they, Death some two? of them found out management, management, they maybe they revolted because they were like, you can't do this to them or something. Crazy. I wonder if this is where Moldaver was from. <laughs> right from the game too, that's funny. Waiting 10 seconds for a door to open. They need a pit boy to open the door. They had one. Yep. Who's? His mom's. Yo. <gasps> Yo. I knew I hope she. Her finger's still. Yeah, I hope she got some kind of medical attention. I don't know. That's right. You get your payback now. I think she's going to give him the vials. She would, wouldn't she? You don't she? get these. You turn into one of those? I love that she has that gun now. Golden rule, motherfucker. That's how we should introduce the golden rule to kindergartners. Yeah. Golden rule, motherfucker. <laughs> you might have to beep that out. I did in the last video. That was like one of the best line deliveries in the show so it was far. So good. Oh my god. Who's this actress? Ella Pernell? She was in, um, she played Jinx, I believe, in... Oh, the... oh my god, it's an animated show, amazing. What's it called? Arcane. She's, she's incredible. Oh, this is inside the... Yeah. Oh, there's yeah, so, they have many so many. I want to know what was this operation like? I'm curious, as if any of you guys are, I'm sure a lot of you are game fans, how did you guys feel about them introducing this, this chem for ghouls uh, in, in the show? I hope they give us a good reason as to why it hasn't come up yet. Maybe it was recently synthesized. I don't know. I don't care that much. It's a very cool plot device, but... Oh, are those drugs? Those are just drugs. What? So that's... Yep. Yeah. Oh, he's having a... What did he say? Small drop in a very large bucket of drugs? Is that water or vodka? No, that's totally vodka. Which is... A, it's a very cute cup. Like, like... For vodka, yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah, look at him. Yeah. Now that if they were the source, I wonder how he's gonna get more. He used to be a movie guy, right? Oh, you're right. I wonder if it's his movie. Is that him? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Damn. I hope you like the taste of lead, you commie son of a bitch. <laughs> Leave it to Fallout. Not the communist. Yeah. I wonder what the significance of watching that last bit was. I wonder if maybe what um, Lucy had said about like, I'll never become, I, I'll, might, I uh, may look like you, but maybe he's just like contemplating that, what he is, I yeah. don't know. Not sure. Probably. Oh, Starline drive through Or driving? Driving. Yeah, cool. So I'm glad oh. I was right about, um, about the mom, the about mom, Rose. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Did the cousin see the name? I think so. Okay. I, I think well, so. Well, that sucks. Yeah, what is... I think she must... So I, I think she's still dead. It sounds like she died during that plague. So, Moldiver got her Pip-Boy? I... Maybe she didn't, though. I I'm think she wrong. left. Like, I, I think she left. Gotcha. Um, and they just hid it from... And they... And... and the dad hid it from them. Yeah. Um, because there's too many people that recognize the McLean name. Um, mm -hmm. That. Yeah. Oh, he did too, right? He did. Yeah. Um, obviously, the one lady did the mold over. Yeah. Um, Seems like she has a history with the dad somehow. Yeah. Um, and the Enclave. Enclave? Enclave. I'm sick. Um, Enclave guy did, but I think that might be more related to just him being a part of the Enclave and him having his fingers in the vault stuff, but it might also mean there's something very extra yes. going with that family specifically. Yes. So. 
oh, how is she going to get the head again? No Maximus this episode, because they have the head, right? Yeah. yeah. Oh, that's right. There was no right. Maximus. This, I was waiting for him to show up. That's but, right. Um, yeah, I, they're going to have to meet up again at some point, mm-hmm. I think. It has to be next episode. Yeah, it must be. We're kind of at a standstill in the plot right now. Yeah. Like, like okay, Lucy's Free going of, somewhere. Yeah. Now we have the ghoul that has their drugs again. Yeah. Um, but, yeah, where did Maximus go? Where, where did Maximus yeah. and Bo go? <laughs> They, I guess they, well, I don't know if Maximus would want to bring the head back to the Brotherhood yet because he still needs to figure out what he's going to do about the fact that Titus died. Yes. And he's been lying. And yes. I, Thaddeus is going to find out about that soon. I yeah, assume. he's he literally lied that he died. Like, it, yeah. it could have been that, oh, man, the, the one lie. guy died and, uh, or, like, the, the master died or whatever, the, yeah. whoever the guy was, whatever his name was. Titus, yeah. Yeah. And now, you know, in order to preserve his honor, uh, his honor I had to take over. Mm-hmm. He might still try and. But he said he he died like the the squire. Oh, you're died. right. Yeah. So he's so gonna. So he's gonna. Yeah. He's it's literally. He's, over there. Yeah. He totally screwed himself over. Yeah. Over. Hopefully next episode. I I assume we'll get back to him next episode. Yeah. But yeah, the 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 title the ghouls was very aptly chosen. Yeah. That was um that was like really really. That was really like, good. The emotionally like resonant. That the was first like, the first ghoul that we met aside from our ghoul um roger that was really sad yeah it, it's like yeah because because i don't know it, it's kind of reminiscent to like um like the sickness of when you forget who you are mm, obviously mm-hmm. you don't go insane afterwards but like yeah it's just the it, clothes it, are those same yeah, yeah yeah it's just really yeah. sad and for people who aren't familiar with fallout i imagine this is i know i'm kind of explaining things to yeah. you as, as you go but this is a good way to understand what ghouls are a bit more and exactly. what they become and that's why also in in episode two um ma june is like you know your kind isn't welcome here there's a lot of like ghoul phobia i suppose is, yeah. would be the word because because there's that's what happens yeah. unfortunately Which even though valid, a lot of ghouls but... like so even without this this like drug or chemical a lot of the ghouls in the games are still fine for a long time and they have communities and they live in communities and then eventually that will always happen to them um yeah. So you're saying that this drug isn't this is not uh, isn't in the game. Correct me if I'm wrong. I we've never seen anything like this. I remember doing a deep dive before the show started on like the whole ghoulification thing and what we have in the lore about what might like speed it up or what might prevent it from happening and nothing mentioned this. When we first saw it given the color, I thought maybe it was Radaway. Radaway is just a thing you take in the games, yeah. like a stim pack to get rid of your rats. Right. Um like radiation buildup. So I don't I think they've introduced it into into the show which is interesting and again i really hope they give us like a good origin for the cam or where it came from and it hasn't just been like shoehorned in for the plot i mean it is serving like like i said a really cool plot device right now like the ghoul needs it to survive all these ghouls do but yeah i'm interested to see where that goes pretty much i wonder what was up with the mr handy it seems like it was so mr handy is the name of that type of robot it seems like it used to be programmed to be some kind of like clinic aid maybe but now it's very okay with harvesting your organs so i wonder if like one of those guys or no probably not given their their demeanor like no offense to those guys but i wonder i mean who they somehow that. they they are smart some yeah. way shape or form because they obtained all those drugs yeah i again i don't want to dunk on these two guys that much but maybe there was someone else in <laughs> yeah valid no valid. maybe they were they took they took idiots also tomorrow. why did they have so many ghouls exactly there are they right? testing on them with that drug are they are they developing it there yeah. somehow like the mr handy maybe the mr thing? handy developed it or something. could be but snip snip it seems like you could get it from more than one place it seems like maybe yeah. in or maybe all mr handies because i assume there's more than one super drug mart or something oh super duper mart super duper yeah, 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 mart, yeah. yeah and there's a billion mr handies yeah right so yeah, i'm just wondering who reprogrammed that thing i don't know his temporal sensors were damaged but that's not enough for it to start going i'm gonna harvest your organs right uh but that'll do it for episode four that was a fun one i can't wait to keep going uh also side note uh the channel hit a thousand subscribers today so uh really appreciate all the support for uh the series as of recording right now only episode one is out uh sorry for the delay on episode two but i'm putting that out later today uh and hopefully we can get the rest of them out a bit quicker life's just been a bit all over the place recently Uh, but yeah thank you guys so much for all the support with the series uh it's been a lot of fun to make with uh 
with Mare over here. <laughs> uh, anyway, so thank you guys so much for watching. Please comment down below what you guys are thinking of the show at this point. Love to hear your thoughts, and we will catch you for episode five. Bye for now.